So, uh, let's play C5. Stuff has been working reasonably well, I think. Uh, symmetrical. Okay, English. so we just go C5 this time. Let's see what he's got there. We'll play a symmetrical English. He'll probably play some Levon Aronian stuff with D3, Queen D2, F4. Or let's not. See what he, uh, what he has in mind. Yeah, this one too. Very good. Uh, what did I play here? Play this six against six Kasim. And, uh, Maybe H6, D4. That could be the line there. Peter um, he, he went for. I don't know who. H6 is a good move. Who gets the advantage from having H4 and H6 included? Well, on sure. one hand, I have the square G5 defended. But on the other hand, uh, he's got some attacking ideas with H5. So yeah, winner, like, do you go D4 or E3? definitely having the time advantage in the opening. If you see his clock, he's uh, behind half a minute. You know, that matters that much. But later on, his my time always catches up, in, and then he just in uh, rushes me. So CD5. Maybe this was actually it. I was yeah. I'm going to take with the knight. It's a shame that I cannot remember. Um, can't remember. Anything. You can see this position with the, the from another variation true. without the moves h4 and h6. Okay, castle seems reasonable. Uh, knight c3. In fact, I had a game like this, but with the pawns on h2 and h7 against oh, like one game, I believe in the World Cup 2015. Uh, but now I don't know. I have a feeling that I may have had this game. Take c5, e d5. Bishop D. Oh, okay. So that's one difference because so the idea of can take on D4 twice. Now, because H six is hanging. D four then H six is hanging. So that's definitely one difference there. Yeah. So I take There's one more I point. Play. And Knight E seven. I'm winning this thing. I probably should complicate these things a bit. Yeah. Even yeah, this feels because I'm down a point in the match. Yeah. As expected. Like something like bishop f4, knight f4. What? So we can play five, either queen b3 now or d5. That's what I did. Or maybe not d5. d5, I just take with the pawn. So we probably should play queen b3. I'm definitely pleased with the opening choice here. I'm getting positions I'm liking better than what I'm getting from maybe. c4, e5. Okay, bishop f4, preventing rook b8 stuff. That's a good move, bishop f4. That's a very nice move because if not, I was going to play bishop d7 and rook b8. I feel like there's a hard, preventing me from hard limit to how bad doing that stuff. Be. I do have uh, this Lani, but here. h5 is or should I play h6 is always hanging. And should I play at least I'm a little bit better normally now. with queen b6, rook d8? Should I play g6? So just are play pointing at least play. half of oh, playing queen b6, bishop d7. Uh, but maybe he should play queen b3 uh, here. Yeah, I think I'll yeah. just expect queen b3. It's a nice one. Uh, I feel as long as he, he doesn't develop bd7. Bishop on, I really want to develop my life squared bishop. I'm never bishop d7 is trouble. possibly not the best move objectively uh, because. Okay, take on b7. Yes, back is not a good move at all. Just totally forgot he could take first. I don't know why I did this. Shoot. I should have played Seems G5. Seems unnecessary. I'll take rook d1. And am I not just a pawn up? I ask the bishop b5, there's knight c3. So no yeah. worries there. And otherwise, I think he's hard pressed to find reasonable compensation. Yeah, queen b6 and bishop yeah, d7 were right there. Back. No that, shame in this particular retreat, as far as I can see. Kind of move one or rook d2. Okay. Yeah, I'm just a pawn down. That was. Uh, yeah, just rook d2 right there. I don't know if Magnus I ever celebrates, see. but he's probably Bishop celebrating B5, right now Magnus with match victory inside. But I think he's won too many tournaments this year, so. I think many nasty options. I don't even know if the guy celebrates his Bishop victory. D6. If he just wins every month. Yeah, that's very good actually. Okay, B3, should be five. Oh, it's not gonna speed up. I see three. Considerably. B6. 
G3 is yeah, fine. Does he have the G4 there? He got the G4. G3. Mm. Okay, just be happy. Maybe not ideal. I was going to say, if he had G4 there, there, that would be there. GG. If it doesn't take, GG, right? I'll take and go D5. Okay, let me think. Is there any chance? No, here? sorry, if it doesn't go F6, F6 and if I go F4, if he goes F6, I'll go bishop F4. If G5, I'll take and bishop C1. That won't work. G5, H, G, H, bishop C1. No, that won't work okay, either. F6. Nothing works. Okay. D5, I suppose. C1, C4. C1 again. Bishop A3, or we have rook C7 at least. I'm still breathing. Uh, yeah, okay. I, I don't have that. Oh, wait, I have knight c2. Maybe I should have should just played play at some point. But I am a pretty nice pawn up. So. But a lot can still happen. I'm misplaying it. Okay, again. King h2. f4. Okay, king h2. And then knight a4 is the idea. Uh, Not allowing a fork on e2. Um, that one must be some Yeah, ideas, right? so hard to play. So D6. I'm not stopping as much as Damn I it. should, maybe. Getting so short on time, but I am much better here. With B5. B4. Okay. So short on time. Keep so short guy. on time. He wants a blockade somewhere. Oh, he's got bishop e5. Very nice. Maybe you can take and, mm, and rook d2. Yeah. He shouldn't have allowed this. Now he's got king f7. D8. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Simply no good. Shoot. Time management is the stuff of absolute nightmares. Duro. And I don't even have, okay, I have rook c5. Oh, freak, he's got knight e6. That's Come on. Because he cannot take on fair. f2, because they're still going to be. Knight e6. Um, there's still going to be issues. Uh, shoot. Okay, I'm at least somewhat back in base. I'm winning a pawn. Take g4. Shoot! I'm desperate now. Oh, what do I do? King of three. Check. So bad, yeah. Go, G5, so bad. Take it, knight D4, yeah, remove. That's a match right there. Yes. Okay, check for G7. Yeah, yeah, good match. You lost some time! And I win. 